Okay, now we're going to install the defroster ducts. Uh, basically, it is a difference between screw locations on the 55 and the 56. Uh, these will actually go rounded side out, and this will go up into the duct, and then it'll be held in by the hole there. So again, you can see, as we show it here, that the 55 models use existing holes in the back, and then the 56 hold them there. Now, I've got everything out of my dash, fortunately, so all I need to do is just bring the duct up in here and hook it up into the system. So it'll look really nice. Uh, underneath the rain gear you can actually see there's the ducting holes that are up there and that'll actually blow up into your windshield. So uh, let's just take a moment here and get these things installed. Let's come in for a view now. You can see up here that I have my defroster duct, which I'm putting with a light. And then I have the connection back over there for the extra screw. We'll come in underneath here, same thing, we can see up under there, we can see that we have the defroster duct already here, ready to go, and again the same thing. So you can see the screw, the defroster duct. I have the rain gear system in here now, but it has plenty of clearance, and again, you can see everything. So everything is fit. Can't imagine actually having to do this with all the stuff in there on a regular basis, but since I've got the car gutted and I'm slowly putting everything back in, this is going to be real nice.